the King's Crown drill, you're going to have shooters at all five spots. First shot here at the one. Then you're going to take one to two forward strokes, then one to two goalie strokes back, and take the shot from the two spot. And the gap between the two and the point, it's three forward strokes out, two to three goalie back strokes back, take the shot. And then this gap as well, it's two to three forward, two to three back. And then you take the shot, and then you're going to, in this gap between the wing and the flat, it's two forward, one to two back. Shooter's not in the video, and you take the shot. And make sure the shooters have a second ball ready to go because you can go right back around. So two forward, two back, take the shot. This one is about three strokes forward, then two to three goalie strokes back. Get set on those hips, and then take the shot. And keep going. Two, three strokes forward, two to three back to get in position. Goalie's getting a little tired, but make sure you're staying focused on quick hip transitions and getting back in position and taking those shots as quick as possible. The King's Crown is focusing on several things. One is just overall conditioning level. This is a hard drill as you get to the end because you're just constantly moving. The other thing is working on those hip transitions. We're going from vertical to horizontal, back to vertical, doing as quick as possible to try and take those shots. Third thing, probably the main thing, is we are taking you out of position and then trying to bring you back into position in the goal and, and using the shooter as your frame of reference to square up on that shot. We're trying to improve your awareness in that cage without having to turn around and put your hand on the post or turn your head and take your eye off the ball to try and find that post and center yourself in that cage. So as you watch this goal, you'll notice that as he takes himself out of position and brings himself back, he's not looking back at the cage. He's using the shooter as his frame of reference to square up and take the shot. Now on this one, he will look back on the post a little bit, but it's also kind of in that natural motion in the backstroke. And a bonus, I usually don't get myself on video, but I was challenged to do this drill, so I went ahead and did it. Not bad for a four-year-old man, but don't look back at the post like I did just there. Again, use the shooter, square up, trying to find yourself in that goal. Three strokes forward, one, two to three goalie strokes back. Oops, left at the post again. And then we're gonna see how your legs are the first things to go right over the head and you can start to see me slow down again the mechanism of the drill is not that hard it's doing the there and back on this drill that's going to tire you out and you can see right here legs are gone tired barely leg up to go get it you can see here when you get tired you're going to lose position look how close I am to that near side post I really didn't use the shooter at the two spot to square myself up Thank you.